What's up? It's Cole Lethem. This is episode five of the Island Rap Show. I'm sick of this shit. I'm sick of my bitch. My son's the only thing stopping me from slitting my wrist. Motherfucker, love living. I just hate my life. And when the hell is MTV gonna pin my ride? I'm rolling the same old red. Hell yeah, it's episode five. We're chilling at Belleville's, where we met up with Brentwood Bay rappers, Paint the Town Red. Let's sit down and take a journey and find out how they became such an active hip hop force on the island. Alright, the first question I got for you guys is how did you guys form? Where did you guys start? You know, we've all been longtime friends, Addie's a part of the family. And um, we first really took it serious. I guess a friend bought us studio time. I think it was for my birthday or Christmas or something time this was at the end of 2007 uh, so we took that and, you know made music and then we we're like oh shit you know we, we got the ball rolling so barn came along with me because you know we're best friends grew up together and then we first started this as like kind of promo we started bringing uh, native acts from across Canada to Victoria so they could you know get them some, some exposure and you know just bring some of that hip-hop here to Victoria so our, we were Paint the Town Red Productions, and then, um, you know, as um, the ball, the snowball started rolling down the hill and getting bigger and bigger, we just like, you know, like, you know, let's actually just start rapping, and, you know, we got a big following right away, you know, in our native communities, and then even outside now, we're, we're branching out and going to the mainland and doing shows there and stuff. touch so we have Addie a part of the group now much humiliation for so many nations it's time to re-educate the new generation the past was hard but the future's for the kids the way of my people is how I'm gonna live uh, for me it was uh, music's always been a part of my life um, it started off I started doing poetry as a as a form of uh, release I guess I was going through some shit back in high school and I lost a lot of lost a lot of good homies and uh, you know, it was mentioned to me, you know, you know, start writing it down, maybe, you know, do do a little bit of poetry. So I started doing that. And then, you know, I just started picking up freestyles at the parties and whatnot, you know, just yeah. sitting around having a 40 with the homies. And, yeah. you know, what, you, what can you do? You, just, you get into the vibe and you just start freestyling. And that's how I started to sharpen my sword a little bit. And, uh, you know, he came to me and approached me and says, hey, you know, let's, we got some studio time. Let's get a show together or something. So... From there, I was I was all aboard. I was like, yeah, let's do it, man. You know, why not? We're doing nothing else, right? So yeah. our DJ couldn't be here. He's on the mainland. So uh, shout out DJ Sergio. You know, he, sh he should be here, but you know, he's busy with work over there. So paint the town red. We're influenced by Joey Styles. Res official in a Cree hip hop group from Alberta, rightfully named War Party. So that's the resident, the genuine, our sinner lessons from beneath the ground sentence. To bless those four elements. This mic, this light, this rest, this life, I represent my residence. Sweet grace, how music lets my mind take flight. All of a sudden, this video comes on much music and, you know, just kind of like opened our eyes a little bit, like, you know, you know, we have a chance to maybe do something and someone might listen, so. Yeah, the next thing we'll talk about is like the content that you guys put out. There's a big contrast uh, between educate and uh, yeah, re-educate, sorry, and uh, West Coast. And those are two very like different sides of you guys. It just shows that, you know, we're not, we don't want to be put in a box when it comes to stuff like that. Like, re-educate was actually one of the first songs that I ever wrote. Um, I was approached by the tribal school out in Brentwood in Startlip Reserve. And uh, the kids had their um, year-end project, and it was about residential schools. And so they gave me all their little ideas on paper with pictures and stuff like that. And I just took that and formatted a song for them. And I didn't know I was actually going to have to like sing it, record it, and perform it for them. Family separated, children molested and abused. And this is stuff that you'll never hear on the news. And then I approached Addie because I knew she could sing. She was just young then. I think we were recorded that year 17 when we recorded it. Canada's true history has yet to be told. So me and the kids wrote the song so the truth will unfold. Much humiliation for so many nations It's time to re-educate the new generation The past was hard, but the future's for the kids The way of my people is how I'm gonna live so much It's a crazy experience for me It's um, This is all so new to me, but I'm so excited And I think we all have the same uh, nice. approach to everything so. Same goals Yeah, same goals We want to make a change and we want to yeah. make our mark here Every 
we watched Addie grow up. You know, she's a few years younger than us. We were friends with her um, with her older brothers, so it was only kind of natural once we found out that she could sing as good as she does that you know we you know we got to bring her on board. It's cool that we get to do uh, different songs for you know what we see in, in our life, and it, we we um, transfer that into music. And West Coast is just a part of you know West Coast life. We just yeah. we love yeah. being where we're from and doing what we do. So we had to make a song about it. We're sipping potion, dank smoking, LA to big city, that's right, we west coasting. Getting silly, hypey in the bay, they go dumb. Now throw up a W and show where you're from. We're sipping potion, dank smoking, LA to big city, that's right, we west coasting. Getting silly, hypey in the bay, they go dumb. Now throw up a W and show where you're from. From the west coast, a BC line in a bag of kush. You can see me buying in the streets of Victoria, the capital city. Beautiful ladies, the home of Nice asses and titties. My wrist is not good for strangers cause we wrestle at night. On the block of the corner of Stellies and Latesse Heights. A place that's known for being party central. Where low riders and wrist buckets are essential. Home of tattoos and some battle scars. My little homie can get in the club with his status card. So it's back to the house party. Sipping potion, dank smoking. Throwing up a W West Coast We're sipping potion, dank smoking. LA to big city, that's right, we West Coasting. Getting silly hypey in the bay. They go dumb, now throw up a double you and show them where you're from. We're sipping potion, dank smoking, LA to big city, that's right, we west coast it. Getting silly, hypey in the bay, they go dumb, now throw up a double you and show them where you're from. From the south side of Vancouver Island, big cities with me when our crews collide, and it's a suicide if you think it can beat me. That fuck you and this peace treaty. BC bud, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. If you step into me, then mama said knock him out. Tricks slow down, you're running with the big dogs. Big money, big whips, big house, big balls. Oh, nah, we're the ones you heard of us. Barn dog and yellow wolf, those microphone murderers. West Coast is my home and I'm loving it. And that's where I'll be till we leave on the mothership. We're sipping potion, dank smoking, LA to big city, that's right, we west coasting. Getting silly, hypey in the bay, they go dumb. Now throw up a W and show them where you're from. We're sipping potion, dank smoking, LA to big city, that's right, we west coasting. Getting silly, hypey in the bay, they go dumb. Now throw up a W and show them where you're from. I just kick back and I watch the sunset. This party goes to morning, yeah, so we ain't done yet. We painting the town red, you bump and dip your ball, laser swimming now. I Throw on my beer goggles, then we going full throttle, but it's gas break pit. Hit the cush and ghost ride the whip. This is it, yeah. The life for me, West Coast, and now who wanna ride with B? To my homies, so much love and respect. Your man, Yellow Wolf, holding it down for the rest. The best of the West, now I'll do it with my best, bro. This is how we do it on the goddamn West Coast. We're sipping potion, dank smoking, LA to big city, that's right, we West Coasting. Getting silly, hypey in the bay, they go dumb. Now throw up a W and show them where you're from. We're sipping potion, dank smoking, LA to big city, that's right, we West Coasting. Getting silly, hypey in the bay, they go dumb. Now throw up a W and show them where you're from. West Coasting was a fun video shoot for us because <laughs> it was a lot of fun. People still it, talk about the party. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys remember your first rap that you guys ever wrote down? Or like, oh, no, I'm, I was like, this is very oh, hard. Man. Uh, how did it go? Yeah, it was like, I'm going to war. Who's coming with me? The punk shot first, but the idiot missed me. Tomahawk, bow and arrow, man, I'm taking it back. Mean mug, moccasin, stomping on the war path. You say you got more thugs, then come on, bring them. Because I got more chugs that'll come in with war club swinging. Do you guys have any, like, shout-outs or anybody you want to say hi to? Or? You know, shout-out to everybody, man. I mean, this has been a great ride, and it's only going to get better. The movement looks strong for Paint the Town Red. Thank you guys for coming, man. Yeah, thanks for Don't having us. Appreciate you coming, man. Appreciate what you guys are sure. doing too. <laughs> Shout out to the Island Rat <laughs>
sure, man. Alan Rapto, baby. <laughs> Shit, this is 250 West Coast representing. Hey. That wasn't Jeez. awkward at all. <laughs> yeah, awkward. Like, high five. <laughs> What's up, guys? Welcome to Confidential's Corner. We're in beautiful Parksville, BC, interviewing the Hurt crew. Well, we up and off the wall with the kids you never heard before. The kids that you've been searching for to tear apart this rapping game. We on the road and almost home to live the lavish life of fame. I'm Noah Jacket, uh, born in Nanaimo, moved around a lot as a kid, but uh, I don't know. I think it was grade nine I really knew I wanted to rap. Listening to old Lil Wayne is just, <laughs> that was one of the best times of my life for sure. I am Ozzy J. I'm from Port Alberni, BC. I lived there for 18 years of my life. Then I moved out to Nanaimo and now I'm in Parksville. And life is a roller coaster. <laughs> <laughs> I like jazz samples and fat drums. <laughs> And I just like making pretty songs for people to listen to and feel better about their day with. Nice, nice. Port Alberni just voted the worst city in Canada by Forbes magazine. What are your thoughts on that? 100% accurate, man. I hate that place so much. The crowd screams, watch the curtains arise. Delay, that's the name that will put you in a hearse and defy. My name is Delay. I'm from Parksville. Beautiful Parksville, British Columbia. Um, I've been rapping since I was 12 years old, performing since I was 15. Make them scream from the front to the back, they like... Got a music video with Matt Child and shit, that's pretty tight. <laughs> right, where did, where, how did that come about anyways? I want to know I more actually, about that. I won a competition in Surrey. Yeah. There was a competition and I like, and I like just, just made it there in time for my set. They were almost going to just cut me. <laughs> just made it there. Well, I wouldn't believe that. I'm usually really organized, but that day I was off. I was yeah. having an off day, totally, totally, so... Totally. Yeah, anyways, I showed up, and I, like, I killed the set. It was awesome, and then I actually performed the song that I wanted to do with Mad Child and, like, told the crowd that, and I, I just remember standing in the crowd, and, like, everyone's around me, and they're announcing the winners, and, like, third is this guy, second is C-Dub, and first place, and everybody starts going like this. <laughs> like on my shoulders and then they all like freak out and Sally and then I got on stage and everyone started fighting and, there was, and this is in Surrey and I'm 17 years old and everyone starts fighting it was like 10 people and then they moved it outside to like this huge gang brawl all the Surrey police show up and I'm standing behind these like bars just like how did I do that? <laughs> Y'all wanna start shit? I got bars in the cartridge. Yo, blood boils, I'm the whole combined. Raiders of the lost, I'll close your island. He called me up and he's like, yo, I'm really impressed with the song. I, I really wanna do a music video with you. And two G's will do the video and I'll promo it for you and I'll perform the song live with you on stage for the video. So I got, yeah, so I paid him the two grand and he didn't do any of that shit. <laughs> Showed up for 15 minutes. Yeah. So Ooh. that was my first introduction to the grimy, grimy raps industry. In the senses and in any one of my sentences, I'm Dennis the Menace with better penmanship. Expect it with every limerick. Do I give a shit about censorship? No, hold on, how my flow is friends with benefits. I don't need to mention it. I don't need the etiquette. Industry telling me I better get my arms colored up like Letterman's. The scars that they are over are better than any medicinal no medicine. I wanna smoke in veteran tracks layer is back again with mask and pen smashing jack till I spin the fact that you're asking is for an ass kicking to go back when rap had begin I ain't slacking hard working rapping advocate last thing you want to do is call my asses whack as shit I suppose I'll send a rose basket to your clothes casket cuz I'm just that passionate about killing artists the darn is talented yeah. Oh. Yeah. Hey, what up? I'm Shane Smith. I'm from Lynn Valley, North Vancouver, now residing in Parksville, BC. I've been writing and performing for the past six years and performing, I guess, for the past two. And I started writing and recording and working with the hair crew the past like two years now. I scribe the blood into the pages of this rap sheet, twisting words and make shit pop like some acne. Pass me a knife or bat and we can get busy. Actually, pass the mic and we can get to killing. Cause I spit triggers, post-traumatic stress lingers. Deal deadly blows from the notes on my phone with two fingers. Leave your hurt, join the crew like a safe haven. And these words are just a noose to get your neck breaking. Like my sneakers have you looking when I walk by. My shit's classic, home run, no pop flies. 42 seconds left, think I lost time. I'm Lane Coop and uh, I started rapping in grade 12. I just put out like a little song on Facebook or whatever and then kind of got around, met these guys and just been with them ever since, kind of building off them and feeding off their energy, I guess. Yeah. 
It's definitely, yeah, I'm into like soul samples and just boom bap old school stuff. Yeah, yeah. So we're gonna be checking out their music video. What are we gonna be seeing? So this video is called Kick It With Me. It's off of my latest mixtape dropped in December called The Realist. You can check that out at uh, hercrew.bandcamp.com. Download it for free. Play it in your car, play it for your friends. Everyone can listen to it. Everyone can be my fan now. <laughs> <laughs> Illest flow to ever come up on this beat right here I lay it down on my vocals, put it up for free and leave it here I'm sipping on my Kool-Aid and these kids tell me they loving it I'm trying to make some music and I hope that you'll be bumping it I, They trying to catch me but I own it Nah, I'm sloppy drunk and I ain't afraid to show it I'm on that slow shit, they want to try to clone it But I switch it up too fast to fucking notice So this is for the kids, it ain't got nothing to do You alone and you heard and you stuck in the loop You try to reason with yourself, say it's all all good But your mind's got a bad than a sawed off wood, homie. You gotta get yourself a light and go and throw a crazy party where everybody invited and nobody wanna fight because everybody excited. You can get yourself a cake, but everybody gonna bite it. Yeah, I still be ripping the beats, and ever since a young kid, I knew this shit was for me. See, I just wanna have a time while I'm young and I'm free. Come on, homie, do you wanna come and kick it with me? Do you wanna come and kick it with me? DJ be kinda crazy, but if you knew me well, you know the shit done changed. Be my mind hazy. You wanna come and kick it? Like I can make you food and you can tell me it's delicious. I gotta win it. There ain't another option. So you can tell us, tone it down, but we ain't gonna stop shit. Shit. You know you got my pill, but we ain't gotta do shit to show that it's real. So who you fucking with? The kid that's killing everything and doesn't gotta touch shit. And she'll be loving it. I'll take you to the city just to go and have some lunch with. I'm on my fun shit. Never been a question. Never holding back. It's picking up. It's just a lesson. I'm on this rap shit vigorously. Come on, girl. Do you want to come and kick it with me? Do you want to come and kick it with me? Do you want to come and kick it with me? Because we living in a world where we trying to survive. So we working out of the vibe till the day that we I just want to have a time while I'm young and I'm free. Come on, girl, do you want to come and kick it with me? Yeah, I'm flying solo. Snakes on a plane. Got these bitches going loco. I can't deal with it. I ain't got the time of the money. And shit's funny because I'm tired and my stomach is grumpy. You feel me? Yeah, I'm trying to get on a flight. Meet a million different fans. Maybe see it at night, all right? This life is killing you. but stressing you out. And Ozzy J can feel your pain because I know what it's about. $10 to my name. Payday and I'm stoked. These people throw around your money and you feel like a joke. I check my bank account. Ozzy J, you're broke. So I hope you understand when I cut you by the throat i gotta get my grind up and go and get my shine up so y'all can come to shows and i can cut you through the lineup yeah ozzy j ain't ever skipping a beat so tell your friends and everybody come and kick it with me do you want to come and kick it with me do you want to come and kick it with me because we living in a world where we trying to survive so we working out of the vibe till the day that we die i just want to have a time while i'm young and i'm so tell your friends and everybody come and kick it with me We got that smooth shit Ozzy J Her crew bitch Every day We almost forgot, I'm not really sure how, but I noticed that you guys got some some new uh, gear here. So can we buy that stuff? Can yeah, people buy it? All this gear is, all the shirts are handmade tie-dye on Vancouver Island. And all the prints are done. Every single right, one yeah. is different. Too. Every yeah, one is unique. Not one the same. And if somebody wants, somebody wants one of these, where can they pick them up? Well, we're working on getting an online store set up on Bandcamp. So same spot you can get all of our music. So thanks for being on the show, guys. The Hurt Crew in beautiful Parksville, BC. Now it's back over to Cole and Victoria. Stay tuned for Confidential's Corner next month. We got Nanaimo's very own DJ All Good. Yeah.
Hi, my name is Shanice, and I'm not famous, and you're watching the Island Rap Show. It's your boy Cole Lethem. We out here at uh, Vibe Street Dance Studio with the GTX crew. How's it going? So what are some of your influences in uh, in the dance scene? Like, who, who do you watch and that kind of stuff? Uh, personally, Roberta Bierman is a huge inspiration for us. Um, I know we can say she's our choreographer for GTX, and um, she's one of the most humble, hardworking people you can ever meet. And just like seeing her work ethic in class and like how she teaches even is like a big inspiration for all of us to like work harder and stuff. So. Yeah, basically GTX stands for Groove Tactics Crew. Yeah, there's usually 12 of us. We really like to practice a lot and it's always been about like rehearsal. So we really like, look good on stage and it's almost like you're planning out what kind of grooves and moves you're gonna do. Yeah. What about some of the music, your music influences? Authentic hip hop music. Um, and we like to focus on like you know, when you're dancing, you want to hit different like parts in the music, the musicality, all that kind of stuff. So there's, um, you know, we like to have variety with like, you know, the chill like R&B or like really like old school hip hop. What are some of the artists that you guys listen to? <laughs> well, like for um, dance competitions, like it's all like the same songs all the time. So it's always like Tyga, Meek Mill, yeah. Nicki Minaj. Beyonce, like if you go to a big dance contest, it's gonna be all those songs all day and they can get like super oversaturated and you're like, yeah. and then when I get home, like when we return back to Victoria, I just want to listen to like Tribe Called Quest and like Nas and Mob Deep. I like an artist right now called, her name is Alina Barrez. She's like really, really chill. Um, it's, it's nice to like, cause we do focus on music obviously cause like you're being a dancer and all that kind of stuff, but um, like having a, a nice like grounding, I don't know, just like different kind of style of music is like, yeah, something more soulful. I also like R&B. I listen to a lot of Biggie Smalls more than anything else, uh, for sure. Um, but I'm also into a lot of rock and indie and stuff like that in my spare time when I'm trying to be mellow. That's good, gotta keep your influences right, you know? It comes from everywhere. But yeah, also, uh, so how did the whole GTX movement come about? Yeah, we started in 2011 and Back then, Five Street was a really small studio located in Squamont, about 30 or 40 students or something in total, but now it's like blown up and we're downtown. Like everyone wants to learn how to dance and people are really enjoying it. And GTX has kind of like been with that journey. It's like we get more like better at dancing and more competitive and we go to bigger contests like each and every year to lead up to this year. I feel like being a dancer, like, it's not just like, I dance, I do this, there's like so much more to it. There's like, you know, it makes you feel better, all that kind of stuff, it like lets you express. And um, yeah, just just like being with a group of people who like really have the same passion is like really inspiring and like gets you going and like gets you hyped, like ready to go. Last year at World of Dance Vancouver, uh, which is a huge deal, um, GTX came fourth, which is crazy because our teacher, Scott Forsyth, who comes over every week, his group took home Brotherhood, took home first. So we're competing against like really high level people and to take home first was like unreal. Like, I, that feeling will never be taught. The fight and the work and all that is in the studio and being on stage is your reward and performing is your reward. It's nice to see so much uh, local talent coming out of Victoria, you know what I'm saying? From dancing to hip hop to everything. You know what I'm saying? So that's GTX, you know, you've learned about them, seen what they're about. Any last words? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, yeah man, you yeah, killed this. You. you killed this interview, bro. Yeah. You're hype. <laughs> Yo, shouts out High Command, you know what I'm saying? Shouts out Shaw TV. Yo, what up, y'all? It's your boy Black Shane here for the Island Rap Show. Tonight we're here in the illustrious and legendary Lucky Bar backstage green room. And we are here with the homie WMD. Uh, so today is going to be the first installment of the Island Rap Show Cypher. And we didn't bring a huge crowd out tonight. It's just got me and the boy WMD. We're going to open it up for you guys, show you guys how it's done. Explode like Mentos and Diet Coke. I'm high for toke. My mind floats and I'm riding a goat. Divide them and poke and move on. Two gone. Chewed off of two bones. What are you going to do, son? I'm gooned and I'm looking for some shrooms to chew on. Moving too smooth with a new set of shoes on. Indeed is the rest bees. You know who the best be. Lyrical Gretzky. Fresh as a jet ski. Yes, and I'm here to protect. So elect me. Flex with an S on my chest and the bench. She no less than the best 
best could be Stand next to the sea, catch wreck on the beat Have sex on the beach, then have a sex on the beach When Black Shane speaks, the pens leak You sense me? Some sensey and some papers to match It's like a badass beat with black on the raps Uh and we gotta keep it fresh, it's life, what's life, that's right, we represent Outfit City, no doubt, yo, check what's next, it's like an ounce bound, sound profound, hold down, gold sound, no now, program, gold sound, now this is, I kick it, witness that ill shit, we rip this, scripture, it's encrypted, the rhythm, I spit like a picture, thousand words, I need a thousand herbs, it's like word to the hearth, it's like it turns the purpose, learning, irking, working, earning, like it wasn't buzzing, busting, like it's nothing, no bluffing, I eat a hundred muffins, like it's something, fronting, it's like I keep it cooking, like it's it's good up on the night in the hype when I meant what I said check it freestyle edition when I step up on the microphone in the zone like yo listen vicious vision this is not suspicious doing dishes killing chilling rocking representing chocolate chicken opposition composition competition not gonna stop when we spit it big ups man respect bro thanks homie mad love to the homie WMD mad love to everybody in the hip hop community here in Victoria it's the Island Rap Show hope you guys are ready for more remember to hit us up we'll see y'all next month Peace. Yeah. That was episode five of the Island Rap Show. We're chilling here at Centennial Square, where the Victoria Hip Hop Open Mic will be all summer long, from May to September, every third Wednesday of the month. This is Colethem. This is Chaos. We're High Command Entertainment. Be sure to check out all the Facebook pages. The Victoria Hip Hop Open Mic, the Island Rap Show, and High Command Entertainment. Colethem's page, great music. Mixtape just came out, homie, and Chaos. We out. I walked through the valley of death. Lucifer to my right and had God on my left. Yes, and I'm one of the best. Blessed to say I come out of the West. Soon as I walk in, you'll be running for the door. Had a taste of human flesh. Now I'm coming back for more. I'm just settling the score. I don't need to use a bet. This is born dog best. I'm just chasing the gap. And I ain't laced with the gap. I use my fists and a mic. I may walk a straight line, but I'm twisted for life. So go ahead and walk a mile in my shoes. Life is a Now she's singing the blues. I wish a mother would test my game. But I'm the candy.